Scorpio, and welcome to your fourth week of November 2022 energy reading. This will be for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Neptune placements. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Not all resonate because this is just a general reading. What doesn't resonate, keep in your pocket for later. It could be something you're not yet aware of or something that's coming in the near future. Um, if this, uh, this reading doesn't resonate with you, please check out your other signs in your birth chart. You have I am Kali from Death Comes Rebirth. You have what comes around, goes around with the three fates. Somebody could be wishing ill upon you or throwing, speaking bad upon you, even casting magic upon you, or, you know, because words are spells. And it's going to come back to them. You have ghost people with the faceless ghost and the haunted girl. Someone's wearing a mask, but you also need to take off your mask and be your true self, okay? Scorpio, trust and believe in yourself. Scorpio, you can do this. Yep, here it is. Be your true self, Grumpy Red Fairy. The past returns for a time, and you have powerful personal growth with the Nautilus Princess. Okay. Seashells could be significant. They are very protective energy. I believe Kali is wanting to work with you, because um, Scorpios are, you know, have to do with death. Death card represents them. Let's break this down with tarot, okay? Please be patient for me here for just a minute. Let me shuffle. Scorpio, fourth week of November 2022, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node placements. Scorpio, fourth week of November 2022, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node placements. Scorpio, Fourth week of November 2022, Sun, Moon, I think those are new placements. Give it Ten of Cups. You have a happy family, happy family life. I feel like you'll be spending time with family and friends. And sometimes it's, I feel like this is about to be such a happy time for you. You may be scared or nervous because things, every time something got good before it, something happened in the past for some of you. What's this from Death Comes Rebirth about? What is being rebirthed? So there's something that you need to take action on, but you're not. It's being, you feel like you're blocked. You need to temper your energy. Balance your school, your spirituality, your practicality, your home life, okay? Work. Grow. You need to nurture your, your manifestations. Whatever it is you're trying to create or grow, a business, a book, a song, content, uh, a new business, whatever it is, okay? What's this? What comes around goes around with the three fates for uh, my Scorpio's fourth week of November 2022, please. So you're waiting on your ships to sell them with something, but I feel like you need to take more action. The little fortune is in your favor. So keep nurturing this project, growing this project. It will turn out beautiful for you. Yeah, look, Nine Cups, it's your wish fulfillment. Just make sure you're not missing the blessing that Spirit's showing you and getting the clues that they're giving you. What is this good, people? Well, you need to take off your mask be your true self, okay? You got a Queen of Swords energy. You're cutting people, places, and things off. You feel as if you have no option because what if it's not good for your soul? It's not being benefit to you. You don't care. You're building a solid, stable foundation with the business, with something, and in life all the way around. You have a Nine of Pentacles coming to you with that's uh, wish fulfillment. This is like um, the butterfly may be significant, squirrels may be significant for you. Um, you're about to reap your harvest, okay? What's this past returning for a time for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node placements? November 2022. Okay, there's a justice situation that's being brought to justice by someone who is immature. They may have treated a even been immature with their tongue, narcissist energy, may have treated a kid bad and a mother. This is a mother-daughter dynamic that justice is coming to. Uh, a scale is being brought to balance. Someone stole from you. You're going to have, your part of your, part of the justice is this person seeing you abundant, happy, living your life with your family, okay? Um, what is this? I am brave. Be your true self. I just heard I am brave, so that's a, you need to say that as an affirmation. What's this be your true self about? Yeah, don't hide anything. Be who you truly are. Be brave. 
be cool about the things you're, that give you inspiration. A new, you have a new inspirational start that's going to end in a celebration once you uncover the darkest, deepest parts of you and love them and accept them, okay? That's when other people will learn to love and accept them. What's this powerful personal growth for Scorpio fourth week of November 2022? Okay, so you got some, some truth, major truth coming out with the Ace of Swords, okay? Going through a variable growth and shift. You got cancer. This could be about a cancer, but this is powerful, fast forward mo movement, at Merkaba activation, balancing your light and your dark, okay? No more holding on to your pinnacles. You're going to have enough money. You don't have to worry about that. You've got to get out of your head in order to accomplish this, so Scorpio, okay? Thank you so much for the likes, subscribes, and views. Until we meet again.